It was a calm night in San Francisco Canyon, March 12, 1928. Most families were fast asleep, unaware their lives were about to change forever. At 11.57 p.m., the unthinkable happened, one of the deadliest man-made disasters in U.S. history. The St. Francis Dam was a marvel of engineering, built to store water for a rapidly growing Los Angeles. Designed by the legendary William Mulholland, it was supposed to symbolize progress and prosperity. But beneath its towering walls lay a hidden danger, unstable ground that no one fully understood. In the days leading up to the disaster, workers noticed cracks and leaks in the dam. Mulholland himself inspected it and declared it safe. But those warnings were anything but normal. Then, without warning, the dam gave way. A 12 billion gallon wall of water thundered down the canyon. Entire towns were swept away in minutes. Families were separated, homes obliterated, and lives lost, many of them migrant workers who were never even identified. The flood tore through 50 miles all the way to the Pacific Ocean near Ventura. By the time it was over, at least 431 people were dead, making it one of California's worst disasters. William Mulholland, the man behind the project, took full responsibility. He famously said, don't blame anyone else, you just fasten it on me. His words marked the end of his career and a painful chapter in engineering history. Today, the ruins of the St. Francis Dam stand as a somber reminder. This disaster reshaped engineering standards, ensuring safety would never again be an afterthought. But it also left a lingering question, could such a tragedy happen again?